Hello everybody, this is Jerry from Killer Clowns FPV. Um, today I'm bringing you guys the docking station from Furious FPV. Um, I've been waiting to get my hands on this thing for a while now and this is a prototype so as you see this is a, a 3D printed uh, nylon case. Um, this is the very first one and I am going to be testing it over the, the coming weeks. Um, but essentially what this does is alleviate a lot of the issues uh, pilots have with uh, bad reception, um, either standing or sitting um, with their goggles on since most of the RF hits the ground and you have uh, issues with, uh, with patterns and things. Um, now what this does is essentially allow you to set it up on a dock and using the same module, uh, whatever it is you're using, the V3 or the V3.5, um, you can toss it right on here and essentially turn this into a ground station. Um, and I'll show you guys how it is. It's literally, plugs are the same as the goggles. You go ahead and line up the plugs, snap that right in, and that essentially turns it into a ground station. Now, let me see if I can move the antenna out of the way. So I have the module up front, and I'll give you the little walk around. It's uh, You guys have the power plug on the side, the uh, voltage uh, LCD on the back, plug and audio plug, on this, actually this is the video plug, sorry about that, this is what actually goes into the goggles, so the uh, audio video out, um, and then on the bottom you have a quarter inch uh, 20 um, bolt, so mounting on a tripod or whatever it may be, it's on there. Um, now this is a prototype, the one thing they are going to add into the final one is a DVR, which is a very very big plus. So most ground stations, uh, as far as like the immersion RC ones go or anything like that, um, the diversity receivers, you still have to add a separate DVR. So then you got to splice a BEC into it, splice wires for lipos. It's a pain to do. Um, this it's it's going to be uh, rigged so you can actually just set it up in there. Um, and another thing too is that the final version will have HDMI out. So not only will you have standard uh, AV video out. You also have uh, an HD plug for the DOM HDs or the V3s or whatever it may be. Um, and this whole thing is its very light, nice little package. Um, being able to put it on a tripod mount, like the ones that I use for uh, lighting, they do go up to about 10 feet. So you can toss this on there, raise this up as high as you can and have the cleanest signal you're going to have. Um, for power, I'm using the standard battery that comes with my DOM HD V2s. Um, and I'll go ahead and show you guys what it looks like when it's powered on. So I got the battery plugged in, hit that on button, so you have it come on. Power's on exactly the same, you have the same system you would as on the goggles. You'll notice back here, you do have VBAT, 7.9 volts, and you do have an alarm. So it'll let you know um, when the battery's low, if you need to recharge it, whatever it may be. However, I mean, if you're using one of these batteries, you still have the voltage indicator and yes I need to charge it it's really low um, but this whole docking station I mean the way it's set up it's very light I'm excited to get my hands on the final one for the DVR as well as the HDMI out um, early on um, they were I believe they quoted that it was gonna have audio a speaker and uh, other things the speaker I don't think is gonna be used um, nor the OSD just because I mean everybody has them on the camera uh, as far as for their flight controller and everything and it's just going to clutter everything else. Um, the one thing that I know is going to stay will be that the AV out uh, plug um, power switch but they are going to add again a DVR as well as the HDMI plug. Um, this thing is, is, is absolutely insane. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go ahead and get this one running. Um, I love the goggles already as they are just with the module. Um, now being able to get them up and out of the way, I should be able to do long range FPV with my uh, fixed wing planes a lot cleaner um, with a lot less interference. Um, so very excited to put this one to the test. But that's the docking station by Furious FPV. I'm going to give you guys another little look around it. And this is again a prototype so the final version is going to be uh, injection molded everything. Um, very nice locking and then again with that mounting pattern for uh, ease of use and getting it clean off the ground for the best signal possible. Thanks for watching. See you guys next time.